BoxingScene.com at the Wamu Theater, where we caught up with the man who will be facing Miguel Cotto on February 21st from Manchester, England, Michael Jennings. So, Michael, Miguel Cotto knows nothing about you. What do you know about him? Well, obviously, you know, from being a boxing fan as well as a boxing professional like I'm a I do I'm a fan of Miguel you know I've, I've watched a lot of his fights and I know he's a top fighter in in all respects you know he's good defense he's good puncher and he can box as well as fight you know he's a, he's a top fighter is there if there's any one fight that you watched and said I could beat this guy which fight would that be and well obviously you know coming from an opponent's side of things I watch I watch I watch boxers all over you know different different styles different parts wherever they're from you know and in my own mind I think no matter which fight I have to think positively that I'm gonna beat him you know what I mean I'm a, I'm a mentally st strong person every fight that I watch I think yeah I could beat him I could beat him no matter who it is many fight fans basically those in America have never seen you fight can you tell them what type of style you bring into the ring well I'm a, I'm a I am mean, a sort of pressure fighter, but not one that just goes forward, you know what I mean? I've got good fitness, good stamina, and uh, I've got a good jab, you know, I, I, throw good, I throw good combinations, good punches. Madison Square Garden is the mecca of boxing. Is there any pressure on you coming here and fighting under the big lights against the likes of a Miguel Cotto? No, not really. I, I don't think there's much pressure on me at all because, like you said, the Amer the, a lot of the American public don't they don't know me they've never seen me fight so they're probably just expecting me to get blasted away you know what I mean obviously coming here to fight in, in Madison Square Garden as well I'm just going to put on a, a good show and you know and come to win sort of thing we've been having an invasion of fighters from England mainly Joe Calzaghe, Ricky Hatton, David Hay making his move up to heavyweight is there any pressure on you um, following in the footsteps of those fighters? Obviously, if I can follow in the footsteps of them fighters, then uh, you know I'm onto a good thing. If, if I can do half as good as them, you know I'm still onto a good thing because they're all brilliant fighters. They're all respected all over the world. You know what I mean? They've come over to America and they've done well. So that, that's what I'm hoping to do. What would it mean to Michael Jennings to capture and take home the WBO welterweight title? It'd be absolutely just. It'd be brilliant. You know what I mean? Obviously, this is the pinnacle of my fight before I've even boxed, you know what I mean? So to come over here and actually win the fight as well, take the belt home with me, it's just going to be it's gonna be brilliant. Anything for the boxing fans all around the world? Just uh, get tuned in and hopefully, you know, I'll come over here to win. And thanks for the support. Michael, thank you for your time and good luck on the 21st. Cheers, thanks a lot. Nice one.